And with that, the Home Depot SEC on CBS brings us to Oxford, Mississippi. Vaught Hemingway Stadium is packed to the rafters on a special day for Eli Manning. But they think they've got a special football team as well. The 12th ranked Rebels hosting the Tigers of LSU. So Ed Orgeron going for it on fourth down. At the three. Guess he's thinking, what are they going to do? Fire me? Johnson scrambling. Throws late and incomplete. Intercepted, in fact, in the end zone. Well, it's it, was it the end zone or was it the half yard line? It looked like maybe the half. Tysheem Johnson picks off Max Johnson. Caden Costa to try to put Ole Miss on the board. Got it right down the pipe. Perfect. Who's been pretty much corralled today so far as far as his passing statistics. This is a handoff and a now a reverse. Drummond's going to throw it back to Corral. And he's got it at midfield and out of bounds. So a little dipsy do there from Lane Kiffin. Second and goal. Play fake, throw, touchdown, Ole Miss. Casey Kelly, the tight end. After a short gain, second and nine, Johnson rolling the wrong way for his left arm. Try to spin away and no chance because of Momo Sonogo. Get second down and two, they can get a first down inside the one. Matt Carell does it himself. Touchdown, Rebels. Johnson in trouble. Campbell closing and knocking him out of bounds with the football as well. It was another one of those spy techniques. They brought four. They brought one inside linebacker. At the five. Parrish still driving. Still going. It's a touchdown. target if you had him on your team from the 49 Johnson on play action this one slides off the back of his hand ball is loose and it's covered by Ole Miss I think it was Cedric Johnson that got the ball coming from behind they've been running on third down do they do it again third down at 12 yep Ely nice move by Ely Terry and Ely Touchdown, Ole Miss. Third and seven. Johnson. Look out behind you. The ball is out, and it's covered by Ole Miss again. Extra man coming, and it's going to get to Nussmeyer. They drop him on the sack back at the 30-yard line. Tavius Robinson is the guy that will get credit for it, but he had some help from his friends. First win against LSU in six years. Impressive win for the Rebels. And now the guys, as Gary said, that respect each other so much and have been together in so many different stops. And one's head coaching career is going to stop at LSU when it's over. And Lane Kiffin, his star continues its rise with a guy like that at quarterback. 